A charity which runs food banks says it's seen a dramatic rise in people struggling to feed their families. In some cases, people are faced with the choice of starving or stealing food just so their children can eat. The Trussell Trust says in the West Midlands, 4,268 people were fed by their food banks last year, while in the East Midlands, 484 people received help with their meals. Victoria Davis has this report. This food parcel means Sunita Davis will be able to feed her children. On benefits and struggling to pay the bills, this mother was facing some shockingly difficult decisions. If people like me didn't have the food bank, then the only uh, option is to go and shop left and shops to feed your kids and everything. Is that desperate that you would steal? Yeah. If it was to feed my kids, yeah. I'd do anything to feed my kids. I wouldn't leave my kids hungry. This food bank in Coventry is the fastest growing one in the country. People are referred here by places like job centres, doctors and citizens advice bureaus. A voucher can be exchanged for a food parcel with enough food to last three days. And for people with no other option but to go hungry, it's a lifeline. If it wasn't for this charity existing, I don't know what I would have done for food. and much I would have been probably crying and upset over how am I going to feed my, my little children. Here in Coventry, the charity says demand for food parcels has risen dramatically. In April, they fed 171 people, but by July, that number had risen to 800. The Trussell Trust, which runs the food bank, says the most common reason people need their help is because of a delay in benefits or people struggling on low incomes. And with winter approaching, the fear is more people will be left with the choice of having to eat or heat. We have a cold winter. Uh, if there is, uh, we're going to see benefits uh, not covering uh, the kind of fuel uh, costs that people are going to have to pay. We're going to find the same thing with people on low income. Uh, I think at the moment we are just looking at the tip of the iceberg. With the rising cost of living in this country, the charity says hunger is no longer just a third world problem, but a very real crisis on our doorsteps. Victoria Davis in Coventry for Central Tonight. The time is uh, 12 minutes past six. Still